Two carjackings taking place just 32 minutes apart. The last one ends with a man shot in his hand as he tries to fend off the carjacker. CBS 2 Suzanne Lamigno is live at the 14th Police Police District where officers have been very busy handling carjacking cases. You know, sources tell me there are at least four to five carjacking crews operating here in the 14th district, which is in Logan Square. Now, this latest victim, when he was shot in the hand, he took himself to the hospital. His condition isn't known. Crime scene tape surrounds a Honda at this Amico gas station at Sacramento and Fullerton. Police say at 615 this morning, a 17 year old boy tried to carjack a man here. When the man didn't want to give up his car, the teen fired a gun at him twice, hitting him once in his left hand. The teen then got into this orange Toyota Scion. The vehicle crashed here at Potomac and California, where police took the 17-year-old into custody. The Scion had been stolen just 32 minutes earlier from a 31-year-old man here on the 1700 block of North Central. He was standing outside of his SUV when four males came up to him. One pulled a gun out while the others went through the man's pockets and took his belongings. He wasn't hurt. Now, sources tell me these same carjacking crews have been linked to several ATM robberies where entire ATMs have been, been taken from areas like convenience stores. In Logan Square, Suzanne LeMignot, CBS 2 News. Mm. All right, Suzanne, thank you.